Hello everyone. Today I'd like to introduce our paper recently published in IMATA, MBPD, a multiple bacterial pathogen detection pipeline for one health practices. The occurrence of disease such as cell disease and COVID-19 seriously threaten global one health. Therefore, a comprehensive, rapid and accurate pipeline for pathogen detection is urgently needed. Taking bacteria as the object, we collect the information of pathogen species, construct a pathogen database named the MBPD database, evaluate the performance of each variable region of 16S through in silico experiment, and finally we could obtain the ASV table with pathogen taxonomy. MBPD database was consist of 1,986 pathogen species and 72,685 sequences were obtained after aligning with the database of SILVA. Most of them are animal and zoonotic pathogens. Then, we firstly evaluate the missing rate of pathogen for each variable region of 16S. Among them, V1 to V2, V1 to V3, and V6 to V9 perform the worst. We also assess the accuracy, runtime accuracy of short read sequencing regions on the five similarity thresholds. The accuracy and the runtime of each variable regions are variant difference under different thresholds. Most of variable regions perform the worst in the threshold of 80%, but it also needed the longest runtime in short read sequencing regions V1 to V3. V3 to V4 achieve the best accuracy. However, due to the high missing rate of V1 to V3, we recommend V3 to V4 in short read sequencing to achieve a better detection performance of pathogen. Next, we use the same 16S data of patient skin to compare the performance of MBPD with the similar pip pipelines, including 16S PIP and MIP. We find that MBPD could detect more pathogens, including most of the pathogens detected in the other two pipelines, and the runtime was also less, which was close to MIP. Finally, we test the MBPD on paired samples between healthy and diseased individuals for human periodontitis, white sheep disease, and plant bacterial wilt to further evaluate performance of MBPD in real samples. We find that the abundance of pathogen-causing disease in diseased samples was remarked higher than that in the healthy samples. In addition, we also assessed the co-effecting co pathogens, providing reference for the prevention and the treatment of co-infection. In conclusion, we construct a large curated pathogen reference database, could detect nearly 2,000 pathogens of animal, plant, and zoonotic ones, evaluate the accuracy and the appropriate threshold for each variable regions. Four length sequencing and V3 to V4 of short read sequencing perform the best. Detect the COSO and the other potential co infecting pathogens comprehensively could achieve the whole habitat detection and prevent co-infection. Finally, welcome to download our article for more details.